subtitle on your book. I really like Repel the Many and Compel mm-hmm. the Few with Impact, Purpose, and Belonging. Mm-hmm. And it's, it feels very counterintuitive to <laughs> that you're wanting to repel most of the people. And so how do, how do we write, get comfortable repelling most of the people who wouldn't be a good fit in our organization mm-hmm. and feel good about it? and confident about it. So I love the fact that it feels counterintuitive and I totally agree. But actually, once we look at it, um, the big difference between consumer branding and employer branding is when you put a job posting up there and you get 100 people, 100 applicants, what one thing we know for sure is 99% of those people who have interacted with your brand are going to be rejected and turned away. So we don't want to just be the most attractive brand across the board when we recruit for for the best talent in the marketplace. Actually, if we could only have 10 applications or the euphoria is just one application and that's the person we want to hire, then that does not make much more sense. You know, I've never met a head of talent attraction who wants more applications. They want more of the right applications. And what's really cool is Still, 38% of employer brand leaders will cite an uplift in applications as a success criteria for employer brand. But then as soon as they apply, the recruiters of that organization are inventing technology. They're using automation and artificial intelligence to deal with the deluge of applicants that they don't want. (laughs) You know, they don't want more applicants. They just want more of the right applicants. So... If we're comfortable and confident about the employee experience that we offer and the fact that it's not for everybody, employer branding is there to repel most people with the truth, to compel those people who are perfectly matched for our organization. You know, And if we get that formula right, uh, and then we do need more volume, because let's say we're hiring a significant number of people this month, then we can turn up the dials and compel more of those right people but then we're in the territory of um, recruitment marketing, not branding. Hey, thanks for watching these golden nuggets. And as a reward, I got another big fat golden nugget just for you. I wrote this book for you to help you get your act together online so you can grow your business better. You're searching, you want to learn. This is a great book. Grab the book, grow your business. Amazing, right? <laughs>